so nice to meet ya. How's your day been? Well, besides being caught and all, you know what I mean. Do you like what I did with the place? It has this dark vintage kind of feel, you know. I thought you'd like my redecoration of such a place like this. Yo, know, especially after you destroyed my last base. I still haven't financially recovered from that, but I'm sure it'll be all just fine. <laughs> You may be wondering why I got you. I was able to catch you. Honestly, after fighting with you for so many years, I guess it wasn't until now that I realized some of your weaknesses. You always protect the weak. You stand against anything that goes against your own judgment. And you have a major weakness to protecting those. They cannot protect themselves. So, I decided to target an area where I know you'd show up. <laughs> Look. My playmate. You are most likely not gonna enjoy this but I will I will enjoy hearing your whimpers uh, I will make you scream I will make you beg for me to stop and there's nothing you can do about it <laughs> hey um us Yes, what is it? Computer. Well, we were just wondering, uh, do you two need time alone or anything? Um, what do you mean by that? All I'm doing is threatening this pathetic sweat covered. Uh, Arch nemesis of mine. Yeah, yeah, that, that's cool and all, boss, but like, you're kind of sounding like you're gonna fuck up. You like, like, if, like, if you want to, that's, that's completely fine. I've heard, like, different villains sometimes take a liking to the heroes, and you know, it's refreshing to some of them. <laughs> What the fuck? <sighs> the computer. This is my arch nemesis. I have been trying to kill them for years. They have trampled my very, not easy at all, very extremely complex plans. <sighs> but if you're offering, then yes. You may go. <sighs> it's so hard to find good help nowadays. Well, anyways. Hero. You know, for how tiny and delicate you may look, you're always somehow able to destroy my inventions. I tried getting you all tired and then it doesn't work you always end up covered in sweats and I'm not able to even get a good look at you and honestly it's infuriating how I'm not able to achieve that I 
Sometimes I feel that I go a bit too easy on you. Yeah, of course I've been, uh, accused of giving you clues to make it easier. According to my so-called followers, I do it because I want you to catch me. I enjoy the thrill of it, of supposing to them. In all honesty, I do not. You're just always able to somehow escape my clutches, and that is not very fun, nor nice of you. I will enjoy this moment, this private moment between us. I will enjoy making you whimper. You're already all tied back. I will enjoy your screams. That's all I want, and I know it takes a lot get you there, and oh, trust me, I'm gonna enjoy all of it. But before I do that, I have to get prepared. I get a look ready for this such a important occasion. Do not worry. You will be uh, safe, at least to the amount that I believe is all right. <sighs> While I prepare my tools, I guess I should confess some things to you. Abomination of nature. And maybe you will even... Explain to me some things. Like, how the hell are you able to punch to concrete? But the moment you land in anything that's liquidy or very not so comfort, you tend to just stay there, all covered in sweat. It's very. It's It's very hard to look away from you when you're covered in all that, especially with a doctor. Slimer over there, he always is able to somehow snatch you and wrap you around his tentacles. He makes me so, so, you know what, I will not continue that sentence. What? Look, you're the one captured. I'm the one with the knife. You have no way to convince me to say whatever the fuck I was gonna say. Alright? Alright, good we understand ourselves. Jeez. For being the hero, you're a lot more uh, daring than I thought you were. Somehow you were always able to just destroy. You were able to punch through a laser. Breathe in orbit somehow. Breathe in space. <laughs> You were able to destroy a mountain. <sighs> I don't even know how you do half of these things. <sighs> I will have to take you apart to figure out how you work. <laughs> I need to sharpen the scalpel before I dip it and dig it deep inside of you. <laughs> oh, oh, I enjoy this very much. <laughs> you know, I wish you were able to make a bit more noise, but you're able to resist this pain. I guess that makes sense for being the hero you are. <laughs> it's kind of it's exciting on my part. 
There has been so, so many times where I've just wanted to strangle you. Just firmly grab onto you. And now, <laughs> now, after 32 years of fighting you, I can finally grasp that neck of yours. <laughs> It gets me all heated even thinking about it. <laughs> oh. Hero. How much I just want to devour you at times. Always able to get out of a such tight, tough, and hard situations. Easily always able to slip out. No matter how much protection you wear, at times you destroy everything. You leave such a mess. Hmm. By the way, I've seen that you've been messing around with another villain lately. It doesn't make me so happy to know that I'm not your favorite. <laughs> uh, it makes me rather infuriated, actually. I just wish. Computer, didn't I tell you to leave? Well, <laughs> yes, yes, you did tell me to leave, but, um, uh, uh, you guys, okay, with everything you said, doesn't it sound kind of, you know, sexual? You know, seeing one of him to hear, hear him, you know, and whimper and beg, like, like, are you gonna fuck him or not? Like I said before, they are my heart's nemesis. I do not want to have sexual intercourse with them. I just want to torture them until their voice echoes these halls. Okay, okay. Uh, see, that's what I mean. That's what I mean. You're talking about making them, make their voice echo, okay? And now you're just making them sound like you want them to mow out. Like, like, what do you want from them? All right, you're going. I'm shutting you down, okay? I do not want more interruptions, especially during this intimate moment. Now, where were we? And he's gone. <sighs> I knew this would happen. I wasn't even able to take their clothes off. That gets me so upset. Oh well, I know they'll come back, they always do. <laughs> uh, I did notice them I and my outfit, I guess they enjoy that. <laughs> Hero, you naughty, naughty hero. 
Yeah, she's got some nice long hair, and you know that she's a bad chick. All the boys stare, can't help it, it's a habit. Clothes that she wears, short skirt and a jacket. I just wanna get her all alone on a mattress. I just wanna have it, I just gotta have it. Rumors all around say her body is fantastic. All natural, not a piece of fur is plastic. Head to her toes, yeah, they say that she's a lash. Yeah, the whispers all around say she has a reputation. Don't believe it till I see it, so I want a demonstration And I've always learned it better with a hands-on education So I need a private session if you get what I am saying And 